The land of time's clock tower had struck midnight, plunging all of Earth's children into an endless nightmare. And worse yet, the Moonbear King had sent Dragon to harvest their souls. Act 6 is getting messy indeed. Well, let's take down a dragon. Now back to Kutaro's tale. Dragon had been called forth from his celestial roost to bring judgment down upon all who dared to defy his ruthless master. And it was none other than Dragon who spirited away the souls of children each night on the tyrant's behalf. That's right. Dragon was part of the reason Kutaro got dragged into this mess in the first place. But now the stakes were much higher. The souls of every last boy and girl on Earth. Having parted the heavens and opened a portal to Earth, Dragon set to work harvesting the souls of children from the coils of their nightmares. Dragon! Bring me those souls right now! <laughs> If the Moon Bear King devours all those, we'll have a disaster on our hands. Not only will I not rule the moon, he'll rule the whole dark universe. Come on, Kutaro! Up to it! Stop that monster! Whoosh! Kutaro watched Dragon soar off with a host of children's souls in his way. <laughs> It'd be great if you, when you open the level, it's just like, souls, 18,947,000, oh my god, yes, oh my god, yes, glorious, glorious, I was wondering when there was going to be another one of these, but of course we're riding Mr. Pink, why wouldn't we be? I suppose now would be a good time to lay down the facts. Well, there's nothing to lay them on, but metaphorically speaking, you see, I'm primarily an academic. I look after a big clock for a living. <laughs> Man, if I knew spicy food would shut him up, I would have ordered some buffalo wings hours ago. Dashingly, Mr. Pink leapt over Dragon's blade like fin. Oats of lightning. <laughs> Storm cloud shocked in vain. Nothing could stop them as they raced up the writhing dragon's back to the heavens. I love this so much. Music's really quite epic as well. Mr. Pink flapped so hard, his wings looked ready to snap. Whence came this passion? Was it rage toward the Moonbear King for using him as a clock hat? Was it a sense of justice, a need to undo his mistakes? Well, it's damnable bad luck is what it is. What do you mean by mistakes? I'm not the one who broke the clock. Besides, the warranty ran out ages ago. That's right. Damn the lightning death that was raining down on him. Mr. Pink was determined to set things right. Yeah, that's not what I said. Don't <laughs> take Yeah, this has been very much a playthrough of letting the game speak for itself because there's so much, you know, voice acting happening throughout, but man, I'm so invested in everything this game does, I'm not gonna lie. You may have probably noticed that, but still. Just, oh, so good. So, so good. Mr. Pink's body caught with the hot, holy justice of Capsaicin. It is convenient there's so much hot sauce on this dragon's back. A cyclone tossed Kutaro into the path of lightning and rain, but these and more he cut in twain. 
Either the clock tower disaster or the dragon's own power had triggered a great cataclysm. Volcanoes exploded in a salvo of magma destruction as fireballs rained down from above. Who would have thought natural disasters would be the reason we defeat a dragon? <laughs> Hero sliced through rain and dodged bolts of lightning as he tames a vicious storm. If this is all this level is, honestly, I'm all for it. It's super fun. <laughs> I don't know how you're supposed to hit the uh, the enemies. Oh, oh, it's probably Picarina. In fact, I say probably. Oh, damn it! It definitely is. Which is unfortunate because like there's just flat out nothing I can do about that. Like I'm too busy focused on. Like yeah, it's definitely that. I mean, it's not nothing I can do. It's just it's just harder to to do. Dragon's trunk was coiled around the clouds like a snake. Meanwhile, it's quite hard actually. I can't remember where I died last time. It's probably one of these. It seemed as though general. I'm on to my last head, I think, so I've got to be very careful. So intense, it seemed the whole sky might soon be snuffed out. Oh, we gotta improvise. Kataro, just start hacking off pieces of dragon. Okay. Toss it, clean off. Sounds fun, thanks. Surgery did the proud and powerful dragon. Did you seriously give him a just cut off day. my tail? Tell me you didn't just cut off my tail because that is just. Don't even make me spell out the dookie you're in right now. Watch the right. Yeah, I noticed. <laughs> oh boy. Oh, can I? Is that what it is? Bombs. It's very hard to hit you with it. And you're trying to burn me? Did that do it? Ah, there you go. That is the idea. I just need to do it better. <laughs> One idea. Are you going to stop me from... Yeah, I think I need to take out this guy before you attack me. dodged searing holes of fire and danced between dragons' razor-sharp scales as they battled atop the clouds. This is really cool. Yeah, right. I'll just smash you instead. Nice. Oh, there's a lot of you this time. This is a cool boss. And I suspect it's not over once I destroy your tail. I think there's going to be a lot more to it than that. Call it a good hunch. Watch the left! Oh, okay. Oh no, I was really hoping that was gonna work. Ah! I didn't I didn't watch the left enough, apparently. Oh, this is quite hard. I also rang out heads, so uh need to be careful. 
Yeah, you're a lot faster this time than I thought you were going to be. There we go, nice. Oh, there's a head. No, no, give me a head. Head, head, head. Ah! Okay, we're fine. This is meant to happen. I think. Yeah, you are super dead. <laughs> Bye. Oh no. Oh no, yeah, we're good. <laughs> oh, this is super cool. Yeah, I'll be honest, this ain't going well <laughs> oh, on a on a head basis. There's there's so many of you guys, please don't hit me! <laughs> like I know how to win, I just need to play better. I need to get out of here. Does it matter that I'm super far away from you? It seems to not. Which is great! <laughs> Because I will gladly be on the opposite side. <laughs> oh! Really oh! That, I keep thinking that's not meant to happen. <laughs> hey, Keeps catching me off guard. Kutaro sliced right through Dragon's thunder clouds as he raced across the ether. This is my sky, my clouds. You don't get to be a wise guy with me. Oh, great. Now we've upgraded to full on dragon breath. Ugh. Oh, that didn't happen how I thought it was going to at all. Whoops. Okay, well, I got my head back, so. Oh, I see what we need to do. Uh, I just need to get to a point where I can climb. Go! Lovely. That's cool. Okay, I see how we're doing this. Okay, where's the other one? Over here! Bye! Do your worst. Bye! Where is that from? My side, so I'm going over here so I can get up. And goodbye. Is that it or is there one more? You wiggly rats. You that might be it. Whoa! This so cool. <laughs> Oh, okay, that was meant to happen. Good. Oh, hello. Oh no, that's that's not turning that much. Okay, lesson learned. That's what I'm after. It's not. Yeah, there we go. Working on it. This is super cool. Oh, lovely. Is that it? Did we just win? That was awesome. <laughs> I think this is it. Wow. What a boss. No, you're not. Oh, they absolutely can, mate. 
So you want some juice? That what you want? Have some of this! What? Hold still, Pep Squid! Yeah! You, you fight good! But I ain't giving up my piece of the boss's moonstone! Not to nobody! You can kiss the earth! And your little adventure! Goodbye! Hold it right there! I've had enough of your bullying and that stupid accent! Don't you make me go full Picarina on you! Kotaro, you made me from Earth, but you're our hero! I know you can win! You can beat him! dragon has been slain, and the souls of the children were free once again. Kataro! Another piece of the puzzle! <laughs> Just one more sword! And Monkey's business is no match for ours. Hey! Wait just a solar second! We beat Dragon! What gives? You're too late! All you did was ensure the gateway between the Earth and Moon stays open! Now... I need only wait. <laughs> Soon, the Moonware King would possess a more terrible power than ever. But Kataro risked everything to stop the dragon. It can't have been for nothing. No, it's too soon to give up. We've still got the Moon Goddess. If we put the Moonstone back together, we can bring her back too. And with her on our side, that half-baked grizzly is toast. We've got to stay positive. Let's go find Monkey and make him cough up that last piece. That's right. You'll get your goddess. Now would you just hurry up? Goddess or no goddess, the tyrant's too strong now. If we get the Moonstone back, Mew should send Kutaro home where he belongs. Don't be crazy. Why would I ever do that? Kutaro is our last hope, especially mine. <laughs> Stuff that warty nose of yours in my business for the last time! Yowzers, <laughs> <laughs> this is terrible. With the dragon down and one moonstone shard to go, Kutura was certainly on a run. But with the witch in the tyrant's clutches and the power of countless souls at stake, it seemed the rolling would be uphill from here on out. <laughs> Wow, that's one of the longest trophy names I've ever seen. Wow. Well, that was an amazing level. What a surprise, eh? Every every level has been amazing. But here we go. Only one chapter remains. Or one act, I should say. The Tyrant King. Oh boy. Hmm. <laughs> Looking forward to this. Next time, we begin the final act. See you then. <laughs>